Hi John, this is Lawrence, KL7L. This is a question you asked to do with the uh, the meter readings between the, uh, the various inserts. Um, upside down of course, just to make life pleasant, is the 1000p uh, uh, 0.45 to 2.5 meg 1 kilowatt slug, uh, which I'm using. Uh, and I'm running around about 200 watts, so the meters are going to be uh, about here on the uh, scale and I'm going to compare it with the uh, 2 to 30 megs 1000 watt to uh, 1000 each I think what you're going to find is that uh, we show about 200 watts output which is uh, pretty good that's just about right on the power meter and about 140 watts uh, shown uh, with this uh, thing and we're just waiting for the uh, uh, the U3S is about to kick on. Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, or 3, 2, 1. And uh, when it goes. So this is the uh, this is the phase meter. This wind's blowing around. So this is the relative phase, whether it's inductive or capacitors, it's swinging around a bit. And then uh, this is the, uh, the impedance showing whether we're uh, lagging or leading and uh, we're just about dead on at the moment. V equals I so we're at 50 ohms. Uh, here's the, uh, the 0.45 to 2.5 slug showing 200 watts which is uh, we're about 90% efficient on this PA and we'll take out the, uh, the slug and we'll put in uh, this one. And we're running about 140 watts shown. So about a 60 watt difference between the two. So you can work out the percentage 140 over 200 uh, uh, is 70%. Uh, is that right? I don't have to figure it out. Anyway, so this one reads low uh, at 200 watts by. Uh, by about 60 watts. And we'll put the, uh, the, the, the proper one back in and uh, back up to uh, to 200. So greetings uh, from Alaska, KL7L. And this is WE2XPQ.